What's up, y'all? Shabu Olu, and I'm too cool to South African geek. Welcome to my channel. Like if you like my review, subscribe if you're not subscribed. If you are, thank you. About to dive right into into the Badlands episode three. This was chapter nineteen. Yo, this episode was amazing. Basically, starts with a dope ass opening sequence of the Daniel fighting. You know, the Iron Rabbit. So the Iron Rabbit and her click. Tell that was amazing in this episode. It was just amazing to see. Then you also saw Bungie and Sunny take this journey where they try to find this dark witch who's supposed to help him with his son and stuff. Like, it was an amazing episode to see out of everything, you know what I'm saying? What else happened in this episode? We also got a glimpse of the war because of Sunny and Bungie's adventure we actually saw the collateral that was happening around him every situation Lydia we found out that Lydia betrayed the iron rabbits but also warned them at the same time and she got to live at her old house and she wasn't planning on being under you know the widow's hand for much longer you know what I'm saying so you saw Nathaniel have a sweet moment with her but she wasn't falling for it. Let's talk about that that dead corner moment, that archer. He was one man and he was taking so many lives. The show's amazing, yo. If you haven't checked it out, you should really check the show out. Like it's totally amazing. That archer was just something to behold. Lydia also gave Tilda some advice that I I'm looking forward to how she's gonna take like she took it well. And she implemented when she went back to the widow. But I want to see how her character will grow from this now that she she'll become a master strategist. And like Lydia said, she could be the best leader of all of them. This episode had MK tied up. I thought, oh man, I thought you had your gift back and all that. And now you and basically out of commission the whole episode until the end. Did you see the end sequence, yo? I was like, this is why I love Into the Badlands when it's like, I told you what I'll do, what I do, no, I told you what I'll do to you when I get my gift back. Then he did that amazing kick. It was just amazing. The production design of the show, the cinematography, the costumes, everything, the timing, oh, like the storytelling is just profound and interesting. I'm really interested to see what's going to happen especially after knowing what MK knows and they didn't show the newcomers this episode but it was pretty amazing we had a glimpse of a new girl Rin who got a leg cut off she was so ungrateful she's like the, one of the those moments where I was like ah this girl but it was a good episode I really enjoyed it I give it an 8 out of 10 it was a great episode there was some pacing problems at some scenes mostly in the Daniel scenes I was like yo still traveling way too much in this episode but you know it was amazing great fight sequences as always so um anyway like subscribe deuces